Right everyone, I'm down on the beach. Still people about. I'm following the track I lost yesterday. There's Bosington Hill, I was right on the top of that yesterday. Um, I went to Helston, uh, the life, is it lifeguard lookout post, or some sort of lookout post over there. I went inside that post there. I went in that. Came down a very steep climb down there, all the way down there. Walked partially around the hill. Bosington Hill. This is all part of the salt marshes. This is known as the salt marshes here. I'm doing a little bit of video. There are people, but I'm not up close to them. I don't know what that hut is over there in the corner. I don't really know where I'm going today. So I'm going to head in for Selworthy's church. That's plan A. I've got a feeling there's buses. There's somebody ahead of me who came out of my campsite. He looks like young. Um, I don't know if he looked young, but he looks like Duncan from behind. Tall, with long legs, and already he's zooming off, but not not in a rush to him. It, everyone zooms off. I've just got to be careful. I've put suntan lotion on today. Um, I still haven't got a hat. So oh, there we go, I just do a little bit of video in. It's so beautiful. I'm gonna try and come down here one evening, I think. That's what I should have done. Didn't think of it. I'm so tired yesterday. <laughs> right, over and out. Right, I was here yesterday. It was from here, I got lost, actually. <laughs> I'm all right now. Got lost yesterday. Only had a mile to go and I was lost. Anyway, we don't want to talk about that. Now we're going to Footpath to Lynch. I presume this is the way. But of course you get so many footpaths, you see. So many footpaths, you could actually go the wrong way. Allerford is supposed to be. Let's just hope it's signposted. This is where I go wrong, you see a lot. I don't know where that goes. Um, it's difficult to know, isn't it? I think that goes a different way. I think we'll go this way. See, they do, what they don't do is signpost it now. You know? I'm guessing. I'm guessing now. I'm on the wrong path. I'll bet you anything I am. Right, over and out. Right, just met some people. Now, I was seeing them yesterday, actually. Um, they're ardent walkers. They were going up a very, very steep pathway up from Helston Point. Um, very part of the rugged coastal walk. Uh, I seen them, I just realised it was there, and I recognised their rucksacks actually, with the belts. 
Well, anyway, I'm surrounded by hills. Um, I'm on, this is all Exmoor. Uh, this is a beautiful day again. We've been very lucky, but it is going to get hot again. I plastered myself in sun protection lotion, factor 65 or 55 or something. I'm hoping to buy a hat somewhere. Um, over there we've got the Exmoor over there. The big hills of Exmoor. I mean, I'm in Porlock, but... And Porlock's surrounded by beauty. And uh, but everywhere you go, you've got to go up. You've got to go up. That fire's been burning for days, you know. For days. I thought it was missed at first. I mean, I was going to go to Minehead today and do a church because I thought I might be too tired for another big walk. But then I thought to myself, no, get out, get out and do the walking, Sheena, you'll be all right. I don't, try not to do such a big hike as yesterday, but then when you don't know where you're going, it's very difficult to say, don't go on a big hike, isn't it? I'm trying to make the most of the time. Now, I didn't... I, ha I had a really good sleep. I slept like a log. I didn't have to get up in the night or nothing. Slept like a log. Um, I woke up just after 8 o'clock. Had my breakfast. Cleaned my teeth. And then I was going to go into Minehead, but the buses are so infrequent. It meant waiting to about nearly quarter to 12 to get a bus. So I thought, oh no, no, I'm not going to, I started to feel better once I'd moved about, although I can feel my legs, I can feel that they had a big walk. Anyway, this walk here is supposed to keep me out of the direct sunlight, and my aim today is to actually get to a church. But look at it everyone, poor lockers over there somewhere where my um, campsite is. There's the marshes over, over there leading to Porlock Weir. But my campsite's just over there, beyond those houses. Um, it's a site I'll, I'd use again. Um, it's not extortionate in prices, though you could say £5 for the electric. But, I mean, if you pay £15 a night, to be quite honest, £14 a night, that ain't bad, really. You wouldn't get a hotel for that. This is nice. Where I'm, where I'm at the moment, I'm in the shade a lot, which suits me. I did a lot of walking in the summer heat. And um, I think that, that took it out of me a bit. Took me a couple of weeks to get recharged, but right now we come to a sign. I don't want to go up to the beacon, okay, because I've done the beacon yesterday. There's Bosington, we've been. Now, now they don't give you a sign, see? But she said, the woman I just spoke to, just follow the lower track. So that's what I'm going to do. And there's another sign now, which, why isn't that sign over here? for example. Yeah, I don't want to go up. Here we go, Allerford. I'm going to Allerford. Allerford, half a mile. Yes, this suits me fine. I'll just turn off a minute and take a picture of this. <laughs> 